Hello, I'm Old Reverend Bill, Pentecostal preacher and Ghostbuster chaplain. And this is the very first episode of the Central Florida Ghostbusters right here on YouTube. The Central Florida Ghostbusters is filmed on location with actual Ghostbusters. All ghosts are innocent until they slime one of us. So without further ado, here's the show. Sit back, enjoy, and may God be with you all. Hey everybody! Hello! In case you're wondering why we're yelling so loud, uh, the house that we're at right now, it's right next to a road and there's a lot of cars and trucks and vans driving by, so it's getting very noisy. Yep, pretty noisy! So, um, my name is Vance Dykes and I'm with the Central Florida Ghostbusters and I've been a Ghostbuster for about three months now. And I'm Old Reverend Bill. I'm the Ghostbuster Chaplain and I've been a Chaplain for the Central Florida Ghostbusters for about the same time that Vance was a Ghostbuster. So we're out here at the Torres residence. Um, we got a call from Mr. Jonathan Torres who said that he saw something in his pool and we're going to go see what's going on. So come with us. Excuse me, Mr. Torres. Hi, um, I'm Vance. I'm with the Central Florida Ghostbusters and this is our chaplain, Old Reverend Bill. Hello, how you doing, sir? Well, thank you for coming, guys. It's a good thing you came when I called because I was cleaning my pool when I saw something that looks like something moving that looks like an alligator and it was standing on its hind legs. Its hind legs? Oh, boy. I'm sure Mr. Steve Irwin will want to be here to see this, huh? Yeah, I guess so. Oh, boy. And when I saw this thing, I... Uh, I ran back into my house and I was gonna call the the alligator hunters but I was uh, afraid that they wouldn't believe me when I tell them about a alligator monster so I called you guys. Well you made the right choice by calling us. So uh, we're gonna take care of this right now. They think they're gonna catch me but I'll bite their heads off before I let them catch me. Arr. We will take care of this. Uh, excuse me, uh, who is us? I'm just the Ghostbuster Chaplain, and it's my job to pray for your safety and give you moral support on what you should and should not do while on the job. I don't know what makes you think I'm going to help you out with this creature from the other glades, but after I pray for you, I'm just going to go lay down and take a nap. Is that okay with you? You're scared of this creature, aren't you? Very much. All right, all right, you can set this one up. Oh, thank God for you. All right, so, we'll take care, of, well, I'll take care of this, and you have nothing to worry about. Well, thank you, guys. And I, just let me know when you get that monster out of my pool, okay? Bye. All right, well, I guess I'll Pray for you then. All right. Dear Heavenly Father, I ask you that you please be with us, especially Vance, as he hunts this alligator monster, and keep him safe and make sure that his head or his limbs do not get bitten off by this alligator monster. I pray the same thing for me in Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. All right, so I guess you're going to want to take a nap now, huh? Mm-hmm. You know it. Right. Well, I guess I better start looking around now. Where do you suppose this thing could possibly be? Hey! 
You looking for me? <laughs> Who are you? I'm the alligator monster that you're looking for. The name is Tim. Well, I got a message for you for, from Mr. Torres. He says that he wants you out of his backyard, and he asked me to take you out for him. So, if you would just come with me, Mr. Tim. I'm not going anywhere with you. Now look, we can do this the easy way, or we can do this the hard way. All right, fine. The hard way. If you want me, you're going to have to catch me first. Oh, oh gosh, that hurts. Ow. Ah, stupid gator monster. You gotta want me. You gotta want me. <laughs> Where'd you go? Oh, great. Surprise! <laughs> Rawr! Huh? I got you now, Ghostbuster! Oh, yeah? That's enough! That's enough! That's enough! It's all over now! It's over! Alright! Fine! You got me! So what are you gonna do now? You gonna shoot me? I've been thinking about it! Look! I'm not one for begging, but I beg you, please don't shoot me! Don't shoot me! Look! You have no idea what it's like to be an alligator monster, you know? Just people always judging you by the way that you look, you know? People take one look at you and they think, oh, he's gotta be a terrible creature. He's gotta be a danger to our kids and pets, you know? Look at his teeth. Look at him. He's half man, half gator. Just, you don't know what it's like. And this is how my life ends! This can't be how my life ends! Please don't shoot me! I beg you, don't shoot me! Your life is that terrible, huh? 
You have no idea. Oh my gosh. Look, I'll tell you what. I won't shoot you. You won't? No, look. I have a friend. His name is Dr. Theodore Stance. He's a friend of mine. And, uh, you know, he's a scientist and he's interested in things that are paranormal. Especially creatures that are half men, half gators, you know? I'll tell you what. I'll take you with me back to the headquarters. And then I'll turn him over to you and... see how you're similar to other alligators and how you're different you know what do you say I promise that we won't shoot you and we won't kill you we just want to perform some tests on you oh. okay all right all right come on get up come on get up oh. Good news. We got that alligator monster out of your backyard. Yep, we well did. Or, uh, uh, he did. I just took a nap. Yes. Oh, thank you, boys, for getting rid of that monster out of my pool. I thought you boys wouldn't make it. I thought you'd be chowed down for dinner. But it's a good thing you got rid of that beast once and for all. Now I can enjoy my relaxation in my swimming pool. So we got it out of your backyard and we're going to take him to our headquarters where a friend of mine, Dr. Theodore Sands, he's going to examine him and see how he's similar and different from all other alligator and crocodile species. Well, it's so darn obvious. He's an alligator monster. He's half man, half gator. There's a big difference there. Duh. Well. Anyway, so it was happy to serve you, Mr. Torres. If you have any more problems, just give us a call. Well, do, and thank you guys again. Well, well, it was been, it's been a pleasure serving you, Mr. Torres. So, have a good night. Good night, and God bless. Bye, fellas, and enjoy your evening. And yes, well, I'm, I'm glad you guys came, and thank you for coming. Why are you stopping? I thought that was all I had to do. I was wondering if I just stopped there. <laughs> Action. Well, thank you for coming, guys. Uh, don't step, don't step forward. Oh, okay. Okay, no, no, no. You gotta save the hind legs for the last part. You say that you saw something that looked like an alligator swimming in your pool, and then you say you ran back into the house, you looked out to see, and then you saw it standing on its hind leg. Action. Well, it's a good thing you guys- No, 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 that, you already did that part. Uh, Vance, can I, can I talk, what? Well, uh, you mind if I, uh, sit this one out? Why? I'm scared of alligators. And an alligator monster? Oh, no, no, no. What are you so worried about? I'm scared that I'm gonna get my head ripped, ripped off. Stop, cut. Uh, Vance? What? Uh, do you mind if I, uh, set this one out? No, 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 let's... Whoa! So you're the alligator, huh? No, 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 no. Alright, no. Action! Yes. Thank you, boys. What a relief. I thought for a second there you guys would be chowed down for dinner. But it's a good thing you got rid of that beast once and for all. 